And back in Taiwan, colds and flus are on the rise. According to the latest statistics from the Centers for Disease Control, last week there were 10 new cases of serious influenza and one influenza-related fatality. Doctors are warning the public that they are at risk of catching viruses in crowds, urging New Year's Eve revelers to take necessary precautions. A doctor taps the back of patients to help them cough. Recently, the number of people with colds and influenza has been especially high, overwhelming the island's clinics and hospitals. Most of the cases are common colds or gastrointestinal type viruses. When there's vomiting, diarrhea and in some cases mild fever, most cases are rotavirus or norovirus. According to statistics, there have been altogether 230 serious cases of influenza since July. And last week, there were 10 new cases and even one influenza-related death. Influenza epidemics are usually aggravated during the Western New Year or the Lunar New Year at the end of January. In addition, the influence of a relatively warm winter led enterovirus cases to continue to flourish, well past the traditional enterovirus season 